morning guys welcome back or welcome to my youtube channel i am doing my skincare this morning i have been binge watching the circle and if you guys watched my last vlog that i posted it's honestly kind of embarrassing because i was on the final episode that was for season five and now i'm on the final episode for season two since I vlogged a little less than a week ago, I'm already almost done with a whole other season of the show. Like, that's pretty much all I've been doing. But I wanted to just stop and chat with you guys for a minute before we get the day started. Just update you on the past few days because I don't vlog when I'm at work. So yesterday, I went and I got my nails done. That is one of the things I wanted to tell you guys. They are pink, and I think it's like the perfect color for Easter, but it got down to 24 degrees last Last night like how can you say it's spring when it's literally below freezing it's been so dry my skin is dry everywhere now like my hands dry when I wake up in the morning dry like I need to get out a humidifier like I'm literally waking up and I'm just completely dry like I am so ready for summer we had a few days where it was like 70 degrees and I was so happy like my soul was ready for it but now it's like below freezing again so thank you midwest weather like you are so great also i doubt you can tell in this lighting but i did a little bit of self tanning last night like i can tell in the mirror but on the camera i'm still super pale i'm like a literal ghost but i honestly was just bored and that's why i did it and i also made zach do it another thing i want to tell you guys and then like we'll get on with the vlog and stuff like that is i purchased tickets for a palace concert it's going to be in nashville Tennessee May 1st like I am so 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 excited I wanted to see them last year but I got really anxious and I let my anxiety take over me and I decided not to go and I've regretted it so now that they're coming to Nashville I hopped on that I was like I'm buying tickets me Zach and Daniel are all gonna go we're gonna make it a little trip get an Airbnb of course I'm gonna take you guys along and vlog it I think it'll be so fun I've been to Tennessee I've never been to Nashville so I wonder what that will be like it's literally only a month and a half away so other than that i don't really have too much to update you guys on but i'm literally so happy you guys are here i'm very excited to vlog i got a new sd card in my last video if you guys remember it has nine hours of video recording like space which is insane my last one only had like an hour and a half so i am super grateful and stoked that i don't have to worry about checking how much time i've been recording like that's super awesome and i also purchased a new battery for my camera as well so now i don't have to worry about my camera dying as fast i'm gonna go pick out a warm outfit i'm gonna wear like sweatpants a crew neck and like just cozy stuff and then we're gonna have breakfast and i need my coffee like you guys know i need my coffee ignore the mess that's on my bed but i wanted to show you guys my outfit the crew neck is from pack sun it matches my nails like perfect and my sweatpants are from garage and then i've just got some like black socks on but definitely a very like cozy outfit because it's cold out and for all of you guys who are interested in what i'm reading right now i finally finished icebreaker and i rated it a four my full reviews on my goodreads which is linked below if you guys want to check it out and the book i'm reading right now is the inmate by frida mcfadden i was surprised to see this at target i usually only see like the housemaid and like the co-worker and stuff like that a lot of frida mcfadden's books have been like kind of cheesy thrillers in my opinion but so far this book is pretty good i don't know if i could say that i'm like reading it fast necessarily but i'm definitely enjoying it like i'm not bored at all with it i'm like so distracted by wanting to go have coffee that i completely forgot to do any type of makeup whatsoever and i already put you guys on like my tripod for like going out so i'm just gonna be like sorry for the bad angle but you guys know my makeup is not super extensive like i'm gonna pop in some gold hoops and probably some like mascara and stuff okay but super quick i promise i am gonna tell you guys what our loose plans are because you know our plans are always super loose i want to go to hobby lobby and look for some spring decor i need three signs for the apartment because i have like three empty hooks right now we're also going to go out to jungle gyms i'm not sure if i've ever talked about jungle gyms on my vlog channel i would be surprised if i hadn't but it is a cincinnati thing if you guys don't live in ohio and near like the cincinnati area you probably won't know what jungle gyms is but we're gonna go to jungle gyms because one of our co-workers gave us this little piece of candy called bali's best 
and it tasted just like iced tea. It was crazy. I want to go get some. For some reason, eggs, like, don't smell good, you know? Like, they smell like wet dog. <laughs> but, like, Zach and I are, like, speed eating them right now because I'm, like, so gross. <laughs> that chicken was broke. I don't think I can do it today. Sorry, Zach. I'm really sad because I spilled my coffee. Like, my whole cup just looks nasty and dirty. Like, look if I pick up my coffee, like... Oh, it's so gross and like the side of it back here is just coated in coffee like I'm so sad and the eggs made me lose my appetite and I also spilled coffee on my pants can you guys see like these are my only really good pants for cold weather and there's like coffee stains on them I don't want my bagel little update Zach cleaned my coffee cup isn't he so sweet? Look at it. The plate is all cleaned up and the coffee cup is pretty much clean for the most part. That's just where I sipped it, but thank you, Zach. So I was wondering where Bean is. Hey, girl. Hi, pretty baby. You are gorgeous, don't you know? Don't you know? You look so happy. Oh, shit. It is kind of nice out, like. There are blue skies, some clouds, but like it is still chilly though. We are about to leave. I just quickly am running George, our robot vacuum, and I'm packing up my bag real quick. Have my ring light in case we're out when it's dark. And I have my extra battery. Like what? I'm a real vlogger now. Should be fine. And this, oh, it just fits. That's lucky. And my battery. I just dusted and wiped down the whole island, which was literally disgusting. And I know it's because the cats walk on it at night. So thank you, all of you. 6.13, so we gotta go. We made it to Hobby Lobby, guys. There was literally a tent being set up, like some type of circus, like Cirque something? Italia. Cirque, Cirque Italia. We're going into Hobby Lobby to look for some spring decorations. I feel like it's really hard to find specific stuff for spring because there's just so much yeah. Easter stuff. So, what is this, guys? <laughs> <laughs> I guess you can, you can sell lemonade out of it. This is like the first thing I've seen for spring. It's an egg, it just says spring. They also have Risen. Risen. They don't have any spring stuff really, just Easter and like summer. They have a lot of um, a lot of stuff for Memorial Day, but. This is perfect. <laughs> this is Daniel's type of welcome sign. That'd be perfect if we had like a cabin. We didn't find anything at Hobby Lobby, so we are going to go to the Painted Tree Boutique. I'm so dope. <laughs> We are pulling up to the Painted Tree Boutique and there's literally a sign that says it's ladies night. Like, I'm literally a lady. What do I need to do? We have less than an hour to be here and then two hours to get to Jungle Gyms. There's like little balloons outside. Can you see them? Oh my gosh, there's so many sweets. Oh my God, that is so soft. Guys, I'm already, I'm already failing because I found the crew neck <laughs> section and I have to look. Do they have a medium? I have gray already. Yeah, the blue is a more unique color that you don't have. I'm ready to get out of here. It's literally making me dizzy. Like, I'm actually dizzy. Like, I've been up and down aisle after aisle after aisle. Like, I'm ready to go. Kind of random, but it looks really pretty over here. Those trees bloom in the spring. They're like the first things to bloom, and they make my allergies so bad. But they do look really pretty. We are now on our way to Jungle Gyms. That's probably going to be like a, what, 20, 25 minute drive, yeah, maybe? Yeah, probably about 20 minutes or so. So I will catch up with you guys when we're there. We're at Jungle Gyms, guys. Wow. I think I told you guys earlier that we're here to find um, like that iced tea candy from Bali's Best. So fingers crossed it's here. If you guys have ever been to a Jungle Gyms, this place is giant. So like, we don't even know where to start. We're gonna be walking around for a while. That looks like a UFO for ramen. Did you find it? 
Oh my god! We found it. It's Bali's best tea candy. Classic iced tea. Wow, we found that so much faster than I thought we would. <laughs> they don't have any of the coffee ones. Weird. I saw some on their website, but they only have tea options. Green tea and then regular. Like literally one bag left. That is so lucky. Look at that. This is a giant container full of bursting boba. Are you serious? I'm gonna get this one because it has a pink straw and I love this color pink. They have the coconut coal. Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is so exciting. Like I was, uh, I was looking at the enhanced cookie dough, okay? And I literally, when I was over looking at the Oh my god. I picked this up. Remember I picked this up and I was just like wondering to myself like is this kind of the same thing? Yeah. It's not though. The coconut. One of my favorite YouTubers um, has this but she lives in LA. I didn't think I was ever going to be able to get it and I did not want to order it online. So I'm literally, <gasps> I am so excited about this. Like you have no idea. I'm going to put this guy in a very special spot because I'm Oh wait, that's not gonna come back out. Hi guys, jump scare, sorry. The lighting is like really weird. <laughs> I do have my like little travel light, ring light thing, whatever, but I don't know, like the lighting is just weird. We're gonna try this popping boba summer strawberry all natural. Pink straw. I love this pink straw. I think you just got liquid. I didn't see any bobas in I there. got a boba. Oh, you did? Ew, are they white? What do you think? I don't really like it. I wouldn't get it again. It's all yours, Zach, because you like it. I don't want any. I don't want any more. Okay, we're gonna go back home. No luck on the signs, but some luck at Jungle Gyms. So, we're gonna head home. We are back home. We've been home for like maybe a half hour now. I'm super, super fatigued right now. Something I wanted to show you guys was this mini brands create that I got from the store yesterday. I have seen so many ads about these on YouTube and I've had a mini brand before, but I've never done the Create one, so I had to try it. So I'm going to show myself making it for you guys. I think I got it at Target so I can actually show you guys. It was $10 actually. All right, so I think we're done taking peels off of it, so. If the angle sucks, I'm sorry guys, this is the best I can do. But I'm gonna show you what is inside of here. It looks like there's four little packages. So they look like this. They're not labeled or anything like that. So um, I'm just gonna start ripping into them, I guess. So it says mini brands create. It looks like just a little booklet. Oh, okay, cute. <gasps> is this the one I got? Yay this little like strawberry shortcake thing. There are several ones you can get. I'm really glad I got one of the cake ones. It looks like on the back of this, they tell you all the little ones that you can get. I'll read them off to you guys. Pork belly ramen, glazed lamb, stuffed pork loin and roast, tropical fruit parfait, vegan chocolate mousse with raspberries and almond crumb. Wow, that one is really fancy. Cherry chocolate cake, I really want that one. Chocolate profiteroles i don't know almond and apricot cheesecake a strawberry cake and a summer fruit tart and apparently it's super rare to get the lattice top apple and cinnamon pie which looks like this like not gonna lie all of these look so good not sure what this is for it came in this little like cardboard opener thing but it's just this like orange piece i'm wondering if i build it on here i'm just gonna start opening other packages so here is my second one stuff just flew everywhere i'm sorry first piece looks like this sorry this camera this is my first piece that i'm seeing i have this little set of tongs so that's cute and then i guess i'm gonna build this so this looks like maybe the base i'm just gonna like put this Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm gonna put this on here, maybe. This looks like it would fit on here. Okay. This looks like a little like tray table. I guess this is like the little plate that will go on top. It's definitely decorated like a little plate, which is so cute. So I guess the plate just goes. Okay, that's cute. That's kind of cute. I'm not gonna lie. There was one more thing in this package. Here's what it looks like. 
it says strawberry pieces on the top and then there's little like whole strawberries over here and then i guess little like crumbly strawberries this is our third container i'm gonna open we have right here we have a plate and then this is a fork if you guys can see it it is the sponge cake base this is cute. Here are our little sponge cakes, guys. Ooh, okay. So this is what I've been hearing about. It is the little whipped cream container that it comes with. so it didn't try and focus but would i get it again i don't know it was fun maybe i was stressed because i was trying to film it for you guys honestly like as the day goes on i am not feeling very good at all so i'm gonna take an immunity shot and honestly just relax off camera a bit i'm in my room i'm on the floor zach's doing dishes so if you can hear that that's what that is i just want to be vulnerable and honest with you guys that i am just i'm in a really bad mood right now and i don't feel good and i'm like worried i'm getting a fever and i don't know i'm gonna take this immunity boost shot it has ginger and turmeric in it it's from vive organic I'm a perfectionist, so like I'm in the middle of filming this vlog and the fact that I just don't feel good is stressing me out. I'm gonna stop complaining. I'm gonna take this, so cheers. Oh my God, guys, that burns so bad. I'm gonna try to drink all of this and I'm also probably gonna take my temperature. I am perching on the couch, guys. I put out my little blankie and all that, so. I think I'm going to finish my last 30 minutes or so of the circle i had to change my battery in my camera so the position might be a little bit different but like i was saying i'm going to finish the final episode of the circle also i didn't take my temperature i don't know where the thermometer is at and i just sat in front of my heater so i feel like i just elevated my temperature anyway a lot just happened guys hold on Oh my god. Another thing that um, is going on that we're dealing with, and I'm not really going to give too many details, is Kiggy is not getting along with our cats, as you just saw. Like, she's not happy here, and it makes me really sad. We like Kiggy, but our two cats, because you guys know we have three cats all together, but Kiggy does not get along with the other two, but the other two are like bonded so tightly. So we're trying to figure things out, but she's so, like she's really miserable. My apologies guys. I forgot to show you my dinner because I was so hungry and I just wanted to eat and I wanted to take Tylenol for my cramps, but I will show you my dessert. This is my little treat. I have a quick update for you. So I was on Goodreads and I was updating where I'm at in my book, The Inmate. And if you guys have followed along on like books I've read, I've read The Housemaid and I've read The Housemaid's Secret, which are both by McFadden as well. And I was on Goodreads and I saw something. Zach was right behind me when I was looking at it too. We were like, what is that? I saw this. It's The Housemaid is Watching and it's a third book in the series. I was like, what? And there's ratings. I was like, what is this? And then come to find out, you can pre-order it and june 11th 2024 it comes out i love the housemaid i love the housemaid secret and it's super cool that they're coming out with a third one like that's actually really exciting i have finally made it to my room for the night i'm going to shower do skincare get my bed all ready because it's literally a mess right now and then i'm literally gonna pass out i think i also need to take more tylenol because my cramps are coming back at like full force hopefully this is not a jump scare i just took a shower and it felt really good i literally took like pretty much an everything shower and it was so needed but i think i'm going to end this vlog because i just want to dry my hair journal a little bit and go to bed so anyway i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog if you did make sure to thumbs up the video and subscribe for more i love you all so much especially if you watch to this point like thank you so much that means so much to me and i will see you guys in my next video bye